Good morning, Flashes. I'm Anna. I'm Isela. And, and this, this is Fillmore News. News. Selfie. That's pretty good. Technology is advancing so fast, it seems like there's something new coming out every day. The way we use technology is changing too. Most young people depend on their cell phones for both entertainment and information. While older people tend to stick to the old ways by going to the theater for their entertainment, or watch TV, or even worse, read, read a, a book. book. How do you use your technology? Well, I use my technology to do my homework, help me in my homework, and go on YouTube and watch DJ Khaled's inspirational videos. Because, you know, they inspire me. I'm here with Odalis and Desi. So, what do you guys use your phones for? Mostly for social media, texting, and calling. I go on Snapchat, Instagram, I sometimes call. <laughs> what do you do? You guys use it like all the time? Yeah. Yeah. 24 Thank you. Hey there, Flashes. I'm here today with Sergio. Uh, Sergio, I got a question. What do you do for entertainment at home? I play um, video games, play, um, watch TV, go outside and play basketball for a little. Uh, you know, that's What's up, Filmer Flashes? I'm here with Neto. Neto. Neto, tell me, what do you do for entertainment after school? Uh, I do a variety of things, from gaming it to cutting hair and to many other things, you know? You say you cut hair, right? Yup. You want to cut my hair? Sure. It's quite man on Saturday. All right. Hey, my name is Chris, and I'm here with Annette. Hey, Annette. Good morning. What do you use to um, entertain in yourself? I, um, I love movies. I like going to the theater. I like going to concerts. I do a lot of summer concerts. Um, a lot of TV. And music. Love, love, love music. All types, except rap. Sorry. Thank you for your time. Speaking of technology, Google has become a necessary part of people's lives. Here's a game show called Google a Day, a contest to see who can answer questions the fastest using Google. Hello everyone and welcome to Google a Day, where we will be asking a series of trivia questions to see how fast they will retrieve the answers from their phone. Today our contestants are Andy, Angie, and Deja. Are you guys ready? <laughs> First question. Which singer joined Mel Gibson in the movie Mad Max Beyond the Thunderdome? <laughs> Tina? <laughs> Point for Deja. Tina Turner. <laughs> and that game question. It took me to there too. Are you guys ready? No. Okay. Which American state is nearest to the former Soviet Union? Alaska. Point for Angie. Fourth question. Are you guys ready? At which battle of 1314 did Robert the Bruce defeat the English forces? The Battle of Bannockburn. Point for Deja. Fifth question. This being the last one. Are you guys ready? On TV, who did the character Lurch work for? The Adams Family. Point for Angie. This is our game for a Google Day with Angie being our winner. Tune in next time. Hi, I'm David, and this is the weather. This week will be mostly sunny with a chance rain coming next week. This Monday will be 70 degrees, Tuesday will be 73 degrees, Wednesday will be 74 degrees, Thursday will be 76 degrees, Friday will be 73 degrees. Congratulations to the Flashes wrestling team for the victory over Nordoff last Wednesday. Keep, Keep it, it up, Flashes! flashes.
that's, that's it, it for this week, Flashes. flashes. Stay flashy, flashy Fillmore. Really? Slightly. She doesn't even. Speaking of technology, Google has become a necessary part of people's lives. Here's a game show called Google a Day, a contest to see who can answer questions the fastest using Google. Look <laughs> like <laughs> Action. Speaking of technology, Google has become, oh my god. My gosh, shut up. Oh, wait up. <laughs> Action. So what am I asking? Whip it out. How's business? Oh yeah, how's business? How's business? <laughs> hey, three, two, one. Action. Action. How's business? It's booming, you know? We're rolling. Action. Good, Good morning, morning flashes. flashes. I'm Alma. I'm Isela. And this is Fillmore News. <laughs> <laughs>